Hey guys, I traveled to the beautiful city of London to attend the Global InsurTech Symposium. And these are the four things I learned. Number one, after the actual conference, they organized the CXO session. And that was really exciting because you had a different C-suits of the insurance industry, five, six, seven, eight, nine of them at one small round table. And they were really discussing the topics and challenges ahead. And they were really exchanging best practice and tactics and tools and analysis and things they found out. So I think this is a brilliant format also for other conferences to bring the decision makers together in a room and agree on Shadow House rules, not to tell anything you saw there, no video, no microphone, no podcast or nothing but really let them exchange things and I hosted one of those round tables it was really interesting to see how decision makers actually when the cameras are off are discussing and sharing best practices and I think that's really 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 interesting that's what I take away from it more CXO round tables number two since London is not only a insurance but also a financial center I would have expected to hear a lot about the future of bank assurance the combination of a bank products and insurance services, insurance products, and bank services. But I was surprised that bank assurance at the Global InsurTech Symposium was not a topic. Number three, I saw a lot of service providers, old service providers, new service providers, presenting their services to the international insurance industry gathering at the conference. So um, I see this as a sign of that we slowly move away from the disruption of the industry into the merge of a lot of enablers. Don't get me wrong, I still think disruption in the insurance industry is possible and we need to be ready. Number four, I attended a panel and suddenly everybody was looking at each other saying like, did they really just say that? And the panel was full of traditional UK carriers and they were actually making fun about the internet and all the modern things. They said things we have not heard uh, over the last two or three years at uh, other events. So I was totally surprised that things like that um, still are being able to set. And this shows me that in one single ecosystem, you can have brilliant leaders in digital insurance distribution and new products and a lot of innovators on the other hand, you still have old school incumbents that seem not to have gotten the message that this internet thing is not going to go away.